Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to import and apply our LUTs pack on different software to easily customize and color grade your footage. We'll start with Premiere Pro. So first, copy the LUTs folder and go to the Drive C, Program Files, Adobe, Adobe Premiere Pro, and choose the version you're working with. Then inside, select Lumetri, LUTs, Creative and paste the folder in there. Now in Premiere Pro, we will work with Lumetri. You can activate it in Windows, Lumetri Color. In the Lumetri Color panel, as you can see, there are different sections such as Basic Correction, Creative, Curves and others. Now to use the LUTs, choose Creative and click on this tab to see all our LUTs and choose any of them to apply to your footage to make them more professional. You can select the LUTs depending on the format of the footage taken, whether it is RAW, LUG or REC 709. For example, the format of my footage is LUG, so I apply a LUG LUT preset. Ok, now I have selected a LUT and I will edit and customize it a bit. I'll increase the highlight, shadow, and decrease the contrast. Maybe add a bit of exposure. I will make the temperature a bit warmer and add some purple tint. You can use the LUT as RAW, but because your footage is recorded on different white balance and different environments, I suggest you work with LUTs depending on the format it was taken and customize them to meet your taste. To work in After Effects, copy the whole LUTs folder and paste them into the Drive C, Program Files, Adobe, Adobe After Effects, choose the version you're working with and then Support Files, Lumetri, LUTs and Creative. You can select and delete the previous presets you have in this folder and then paste the LUTs pack folder in there or keep them both. In After Effects, in the Effects and Presets panel, choose Lumetri Color and drop it on your footage. And in Creative section, click on the Look tab. And you can see all the LUTs here. And as said before, it's better to choose the LUTs depending on the format of your footage whether it's taken as log, raw, or rec 709. You can edit the intensity of the lot on your footage by decreasing or increasing it, and also customize it by adding contrast, highlights, and shadows. Well, it all depends on how you like your footage to look. To use the lots in Photoshop, copy the lots folder, go to Drive C, Program Files, Adobe, Adobe Photoshop and choose the version you're working with. Then presets, 3D lots and again you can delete all the previous lots you have in here and the paste the lots folder. This way it looks more organized. In Photoshop go to adjustment and color lookup and click on 3D lots and you can see all the lots in there. All the LUTs color presets are laboratory made, so it's better to apply them depending on the format of your footage. Therefore, you won't have any images in high contrast, like this image. Let's play a bit with the LUTs and see how they look in this image. For example, the uh, standard format LUTs have lower contrast as shown here. Using the LUTs color presets in Final Cut differs slightly from the Adobe software, but is simpler. All you need to do is in the Effects panel, select the custom LUT and drop it onto your footage. Then in the LUT section, choose Custom LUT and import the whole Pixel LUTs pack folder. This way, you have all our LUTs always in Final Cut and easily apply any of them on your footage based on the format of the footage recorded. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to us for more new video uploads.